Hey, it's Ellen, and welcome to the March Easing. Yesterday, Gail and I went down to Davis Correctional. It's a prison down in Oklahoma, and we do a business planning class with the inmates there. Now, they have to apply for this class. It's an exclusive group. These are guys who are willing to put in the time, energy, and effort that it takes to put together a rockin' business plan. It is a really inspiring day when we go down there, and yesterday was graduation day. So the fellows presented their business plans. The business plans were rockin' fantastic. From very modest cleaning companies all the way to multi-divisional empires, these business plans were amazing reflections of the dreams and the commitment of the fellows who put them together. I love business planning. And, you know, I understand that the fellows who find themselves in prison have to take responsibility for their circumstances, and they do. But here's what I know, they're going to be released, some of them in short order and some of them years from now. And in order for them to re-enter society in a successful, positive way, well, we can help them by helping them learn business skills, enhancing their natural entrepreneurialism in productive ways. This is good for them, and it's good for all of us as a society. So. Having spent some time down at the facility with these guys working on their business plans, it's been great to try out the bare bones biz plan and get some good feedback from them. Is it easy to understand? Is the format of our, our business planning process useful to them? Thanks guys for all your help. And thanks to you who put your business plans together using the bare bones biz plan because that feedback has led to our latest, greatest product. We're calling it the weekend biz plan. Now, the Weekend Biz Plan is a mini version of the Bare Bones Biz Plan. The intention was how simple could we make the business planning process? And I thought, what if you committed to one weekend, starting Friday afternoon by Sunday afternoon, could you have a rockin' good business plan and hit the ground running on Monday? That was the inspiration for the Weekend Biz Plan. And ta-da, we're ready to unveil that in this easy. And so if you click on the link below, you can check out the Weekend Biz Plan. It's got a smaller price tag too. We're really excited about this book. And if you will let me help you, I'm gonna take you through the business planning process from Friday afternoon, all day Saturday, Sunday. There's breaks, there's snacks, there's things, exercises for you to do. But at the end of this time together, you and I are going to create a rockin' business plan. This can help you get your business turned around, jump-started, or maybe started in the first place if you've got an idea and you've just really never energized it. The Weekend Biz Plan may be a great way for you to get it go, go, going. All right, so we are here to help any way we can. We love being of service to any business builder, you included. So know that the information in the bare bones biz plan, even the weekend biz plan, it's not magic, it's just a tool. And we encourage you to pick up these tools and use them to good effect for you and your business, for your family, for your community, for your team. It doesn't really matter which tool you pick up. We're happy to be of service. What I want to encourage you to do, as I encouraged the guys yesterday, don't let any rock stand in the way of you and your dream. Don't talk about the odds. Don't look at statistics. Don't listen to other people tell you how hard it is or how much blood, sweat, and tears need to go into your business for it to be successful. Forget that. And don't pay attention to anything that's going to take you off track. Instead, consider only what you want to have happen, and put a little plan together for making your dreams come true. We wish you love, peace, lots of money, and the freedom that is inherent in a business of your own. So check out the Weekend Biz Plan and be sure to check out the rest of the easing. We've got great stuff coming up. Wait till you see our two radio guests. Oh, such an exciting month March is. See you later.